So with all of those powerhouse names coming out and the Nasdaq sitting at an all-time high, tech investors should have a lot to smile about, right? Well, as Bob Pisani tells us, a worrisome trend is starting to reveal itself. There is a big problem in tech right now. The Nasdaq 100 is up 6% this month to a 15-year high, but the leadership is very narrow. Right now, there's really four technology stocks that matter. Google, Amazon, Facebook, and Apple. That's it. Google's up 29% in July, Amazon's up 11%, Facebook's up 10%, and Apple's up 3%. This is just for the month of July. It's an amazing run. The problem is the market capitalization of these companies are so big, they're distorting the indexes, which are weighted by market capitalization. Together, the four companies have a market cap of $1.7 trillion. Now, the Nasdaq's 100's market cap is $5.4 trillion. So do the math. These four stocks account for 31% of the value of the Nasdaq 100. Four stocks. Is there a tech bubble going on? It, not really. Most stocks have not had huge run-ups this year, even tech, and most are not overly expensive. Apple, for example, is only 15 times forward earnings. Google, 23 times. That's not really very expensive. The problem is there's no growth in the world, so everyone is crowded into very few names, like those big four I mentioned, that have any kind of growth. But those stocks keep getting bigger and bigger at the expense of everybody else. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Bob Pisani at the New York Stock Exchange.